Hello y'all and welcome back to my channel. It is Monday and I am doing a vlog but I've been excited about it. If you've been on my channel for a while you know that I am getting into fringe resistance reenacting and I have been looking for a gun for my impression. Um, I was gonna settle for a K98 but I have been looking all over and couldn't find one so a few weeks ago we went to a pawn shop and I found a 1918 Lee Enfield rifle which were used a lot among the French resistance so that was originally the kind of rifle that I wanted almost a year ago when I started learning about this and getting into this hobby. I'm going to show y'all what it looks like, um, show you the ammo that I bought for it and I have some other things that are coming in the mail today that I bought specifically to go with this gun. I'm going to try to shoot it today for the first time and I've done all the um, cleaning and I've done some like inspected some certain parts of it so hopefully that it'll be 100% safe and not any surprises <laughs> when I go to shoot it for the first time so I'll show you really quickly what it looks like so there's a few like dents and stuff in the wood but that's okay it's 103 year old rifle so i'm okay with that a few little spots on it uh it was missing the cleaning rod that would normally go right here but that's okay so i think probably the coolest thing on this for me is this magazine i always am fascinated with gun magazines and this one is just so cool to me um so i bought two boxes of 303 british bullets they're kind of hard to find so you have to order them online i've looked a lot of places gun stores and pretty much anywhere that i would think would have ammo and they didn't have any of it so i have got this brand right here and i bought a bandolier for a infield off ebay so i have a sling and then some stripper clips coming from amazon today uh but yeah that's kind of exciting for me i've been i've never had my own guns this is my first gun and my first experience with this kind of thing so i'm excited to try it out i'm going to shoot it some today and uh see how that goes with shooting it for the first time um hopefully there won't be any issues it's always kind of scary shooting an old firearm because you never really know if there's anything wrong down inside i will i'm going to just do some close-up shots Okay, so we just got back from shooting the infield and we fired about three rounds with we pulled it with a string first to make sure it wasn't gonna like explode or anything and then Sarah and I both shot some so overall I'd say it is a very good rifle it's very sturdy and I expected the kick to be way worse than it actually was it really wasn't that bad I'd uh, compare the kick to a K98 with blanks um, it just depends on how you're holding the rifle and how you're leaning into it and um, just how you're standing your ground. Yeah, 
anyway, I hope y'all enjoyed this video. If you enjoyed watching it, just leave me a comment below and um, like, share, and subscribe. Thank you so much for watching and Jesus saves.